Have you ever tried to find a circuit and you keep turning the wrong ones off over and over again? Well, I've got a little trick for you guys. So stick around guys, because I think you're gonna really enjoy this one. All right guys, welcome back to my channel. Today what I wanna do is I wanna talk to you a little bit about something that is pretty amazing. Now, I did a video, a small video on uh, this tracer, this uh, circuit binder by Klein. It is amazing guys. I think it is one of, one of the best tracers I've had. I've had the ideal, which was way more. I think I paid like a thousand, a little over a thousand for it. This thing here, I'll leave a link down below because it is amazing guys. Uh, I got a little trick with a tick tracer that you guys may want to stick around because I've been too many places where you go to find a circuit only to find out that you flip the breaker and all of a sudden you're turning the wrong circuit off. Even though you pretty much dialed it in, this little trick will save you a lot of time, especially when you're in houses like this because we're remodeling this house right now. And um, yeah, I think it's pretty amazing, this little trick. now. It's not the end all be all, it's just another trick that you guys can use to make sure that when you're trying to find, you know, a receptacle circuit, you know, any of them, that when you do that, you definitely find out the right one. You're not turning something off that you're not supposed to, you know, maybe you have an oxygen machine or whatever. So it's pretty important guys to basically know how your tools work because you can get in a lot of trouble pretty quick. So anyway, I just want to show you guys real quick. I'm going to take you in here to the kitchen. It's pretty amazing. All right, I feel like I should do this now because I probably won't ever have the opportunity again. So we're remodeling this house. And you see, I've got my tick tracer, my Klein tick tracer hooked to this wire. Now, sometimes these things are pretty accurate. Sometimes they're not. You get them kind of close. But let me show you what I found out about this. So I have it on, let's turn it on, let's turn it on so we can see, here we are. All right, I have it on number eight, which I put here, eight is the most sensitive because I can never remember. So I'll put it down to five, and you see, it reads pretty good. So what I found out, that if you have your tracer, right, the transmitting part of it hooked with the clip clip jumpers, you can take your tick tracer here and it will show you which one it is for sure. Now, I'll show you exactly what I'm talking about here. This is pretty neat. So you see how, because it's sending a tone, here it's not doing anything. I mean, there is no power. The meter is completely out of the equation. There's nothing. So it does it over here also, see? So it verifies that is transmitting. So if you're in a place where there's computers or whatever, and you need to find the exact wire, you got a whole bunch of wires right here. That's the best way to do it. Because sometimes, even though you're, you think you're dead on, sometimes you're really not. And with this, using this, it's damn near perfect. It shows you exactly where it is. I'm sorry about the audio. Uh, I'm just here with my cell phone. I felt like I had to show this because I stumbled upon this by accident, but it's so great. And I don't know anybody who knows that trick except me now and everybody else who watched this video. So there you go. All right, something else I want to show you. You see, I got a hook now. We found that one and we found this one. All right, and what I did is I put it back on a different and I want to show you something else. So you see how it's blinking, right? We're going to go over here because I'm pretty certain that's either the end of the line or it keeps going. I'm not sure. So. Will it work through a receptacle? Let's see. Oh yeah. So we know it's exactly right. But you can say it works through the receptacle now. Guys, I'm giving you all of my little tips and tricks for free. So you better like and subscribe. So there'll be a lot more videos coming like this. I think these little tips and tricks, especially if you pay a lot of money for this tracer, I've been in too many places where I've tried to figure out if that is the right circuit or not. And when I go to turn the breaker off, well, <laughs> it's not the right circuit. And I end up turning a computer off or something else off, and that's no fun. Or, you know, an air conditioner or whatever, you know, in the case may be. But this little trick is pretty amazing. So if you're interested in wiring up a three-way switch, which is pretty easy, I will have a video coming up right here to the side. You can check it out. 
and I'll see you in that video. If you like what you see, like and subscribe. God bless, and we'll see you on the next one. Have a great day.